the Kogi State Auditor General for Local Government, Honorable Yakub Siaka Adabenege, has charged newly elected local government chairmen, along with directors of local government and their treasurers, to emulate Governor Ahmed Yusman Ododo's transparency, accountability, and good governance style. Honorable Adabenege made this statement on Tuesday, November 12th, in Lokoja, while addressing the chairman, the LGs, and their treasurers in a maiden meeting to emphasize the importance of financial discipline and adherence to financial instructions. His Excellency Elijah Medisman of Dua is consolidating on the template of Elijah Belu. And you people are emulating him to extend it down to the grassroots. For them to enjoy that privilege. Based on that, a lot of matters have been considered. Which one of it is transparency and accountability? The Office of Autonomy for Local Government, the statutory office, is in charge of every cup of instead thing that the local government level to be accounted for. Many people have been given the mandate. Look at the public funds of the central local government across the states, and as such, we must be diligent, we must be judicious, and we must be accountable at the end of the day. Based on that, we need to have a robust relationship to guide how that can be done without any problem. The issue of local government autonomy. Has come to stay. Provinces have been practicing autonomy before the federal government now making mandatory that all the 774 local government must go into local government autonomy. Since 2016, the forms, all the local government allocations have been disposed to local government accounts. All the local government are spending and making the expenditure from their local government, respective local government accounts. And that is what we've been practicing since His Excellency, the former governor, but they still like have been on board. When you check the record before them, it wasn't like that. In his speech, the Director for Audit Services, Mr. Chris Emanuel, said the meeting was to ensure that local governments manage their finances prudently and in accordance with established regulations and best practices. The uh, civil servants have been around for a while. But they need to hear from the horse's mouth, not in the to the lines, of course, but by virtue of Section 125 of the Constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. Another extension of this law of the State Auditor as amended in 2021, financial regulation and financial memorandum is empowered to monitor and uh, guide you in how you depend, dispense public resources as such this meeting. The chairman of Yagba East, who doubles as the Algon chairman of the state, Honorable Ulu Kuntosin, appreciates the Auditor General for local government for the robust engagement and assurance of adherence to fiscal transparency and accountability. The process, you know, is something that we have been taught even from the GYB period. And then that's what we are still enjoying, just like what I said, I've been in this government since 2016. And they have been following the process in, in doing things in various local governments. As we are just coming new on board, we just have to also be pushed through so that we know that this uh, administration stands for transparency and we are, need to maintain integrity too. Based on this uh, interface, the way we've interacted this afternoon, is something that gives each side a good confidence. As in the DIGs are happy with the chairman, we are all happy. And then uh, with the cooperation that we are planning ahead, it will make things to be more smooth for us.